So what's the point in making art? The point is to make so you can share. So you make and share and you make and share and you make and share. I'm Chantal Martin and I draw. I'm drawing on canvases, I'm drawing on walls, I'm drawing on cars, I'm drawing on shirts, I'm drawing on shoes. 99% of that is done live. When you're drawing live, you have no time to think, you have no time to hesitate, you have no time to plan. You have no time to be anyone else. So this is the cover of the, uh, the home and garden section. And it's, it's funny, I didn't know it was a big deal at the time, so I, I only bought one copy. So if you have an extra spare copy out there, I'd take it. I remember my art teacher telling me, Chantel, don't apply for art school because you're not good enough and you won't get in. At that point, people were only telling me what I couldn't do, so I ran away. I started my career in Japan in a culture that was craft-based, in a culture where people learn things and practice things over generations, over long periods of time. And I remember thinking to myself, what can I master in my lifetime? What could I become profoundly confident with? What about a line? You know, I draw, I love drawing. We all draw. So with these and these, I'm gonna draw like this. What kind of hard work and patience would it take so that when I draw a line, it is recognisably mine. Moving to York was very humbling because if no one knows who you are, they don't care who you are. And everyone is an artist. And you start to lose yourself. You start to lose your way. And so I decided, well, I'm not going to not make art because you won't show it. I'm going to draw and make the world my canvas and I'm going to use any drawing tool that I can get my hands on. I'm going to draw and 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 I'm going to share and share and share and share and share and draw. Just give me a pen and I'll make something. You follow the pen and you allow it to flow and you allow it to go wherever it needs to go, wherever it wants to take you. You are a willing passenger. And now you repeat that, and you repeat that, and you repeat that, and you repeat that. But over time, you get to extract what you look like. Over time, you get to extract what your line feels like. Something that is recognizably yours. We have this contact between our head and our hand. And it doesn't matter what industry you're in. It comes down to drawing. It comes down to that initial mark that you make. And without this pen, I wouldn't have traveled. I wouldn't have collaborated. This tool has allowed me to discover who I am. Goodbye.